साध्वी भरद्वाज भरद्वाज एंड टेबल सर ही इज अ ऋषि ही इज वन ऑफ सप्त ऋषि ही इज एन इकोनॉमिस्ट एंड ही इज अ ग्रामेरियन ही कंट्रीब्यूटेड हिज लिटरेचर एंड हिज इमेंस थॉट्स टू ऋग्वेदा एंड एंड आल्सो इट्स माय गोत्रा सर सो गोत्रा अकॉर्डिंग टू दैट माय पार्टी so he said your hobby is taking responsibilities yes sir okay sir it's a it's a state uh, when uh, what uh, we are taking some duties hmm. managing something it may be in uh, different aspects like economic aspect or uh, supporting the people or etc so i like to take up uh, a, a big challenge hmm. so uh as my hobby i took uh, you, uh, civil services as my ambition so you said your gotra is bharadwaj right yes. what is the meaning of gotra sir uh gotra in the sense uh, i think it's a, uh, a family name type mm, no is there any exact meaning for that no sir i'm not sure gotra is actually you know it's like goshala okay, scopen okay. you know it is mentioned in other veda okay. where people of all the family like we keep all our cows together right all cattle together yes. so that is the meaning of gotra the okay. npsc when you say gotra it's quite possible that they would ask what is the meaning so it was mentioned in atharva veda just remember that sure. do you aware about nadu nadu program yes sir so how it is created an impact on school education okay sir so basically nadu nadu is a program Uh, which was implemented, uh, which was implementing by the uh, government of Andhra Pradesh. Uh, sir, as actually it was uh, inaugurated by uh, Chief Minister Jagan Mohan Reddy. So uh, its its basic uh, its aim is to uh, provide all the facilities uh, and uh, to construct infrastructure in the schools like uh, restrooms and uh, digital uh, boards and. Uh, A, te- a technological uh, classrooms, etc. And as a, uh, in the part of this Nadu Nadu program, they are uh, providing uh, clean drinking water, etc. Very good. Okay, that good. is the exact thing you have to say. Nice. So good. your knowledge of current affairs is good. Okay. okay. And your expression is nice. So good. So Continue uh, to study. I want to tell about my uh, motherland, sir. Okay. Uh, I'm I'm from Sri Kakulam, basically. so uh, it's it's a religious uh, tourism place uh, it is known for its uh, pilgrimage uh, site and um, to explore my motherland uh, uh, everyone should know about my motherland that's my aim sir so uh, uh, it has a sun temple sir uh, so that that was built by uh, virendra varma in 7th uh, century sir and uh, it has a this composite culture one side it is bordering from uh, bay of bengal and another side from eastern ghats uh, and and the third side from odisha it it is a spot uh, where we explore everything in the andhra pradesh recently there there are uh, a new port which was announced by government of uh, andhra pradesh that is amolapadu port sir in bavana bavanapadu uh, and more, more than 10000 people uh like fishermen they are uh living uh, in the basis of that marine resources so to improve that uh, production economy of the andhra pradesh it is a uh, keep spot sir so molapeta why earlier it is called bawan padu port no yes. why name was changed sir i think uh, maybe for uh, some political reasons and uh, no maybe. not for political reasons actually the farmers who are giving the land Okay. are actually under molapeta yes, village so they protested district collector has a meeting yes. so they protested we are giving land why do you want to name it as bhavanapadu okay. that is the point okay. good 